you got your, uh, your bomb bay doors here, and typically when you did an attack, the bomb bay doors opened uh, in about two seconds. Uh, the bomb would come out, and then the, the, the bomb bays would close, so you had about eight seconds total of vulnerability. So when that door opens, you went from a 0.001 RCS, you know, radar cross-section, to, you know, basically a B-52. So, <laughs> so you want to minimize that time as much as possible because usually you're in the most high-threat environment at that, at that moment. And, you know, it was a big deal if that door came open and then stuck open. And so we had proceed, emergency procedures that we would practice if that door stuck open. But the door would come down, and now uh, the, this looks like a GD-27 here, uh, would be loaded up in, into the guts of the airplane. And uh, the airplane, it, it's mounted on what's called, we call it a, trap, a, a trapeze. And the trapeze would swing down, down to right about here, and that's how the, the munitions loaders then would load the airplane. They would, so the bombs would be hanging way down, and they get the bomb motor up underneath, loaded in, and then uh, when, when we started the motors, they would raise the traps, traps would go up in the airplane, and then they would lock the traps. So it would be a locked up trap uh, uh, release. So the initial uh, releases in the 117, early in the program, they would they would, the door would come down, and, the, and then the traps would come down. It was a very lethargic, uh, lengthy process. But, the, and I think that's because they were worried about the bombs actually impacting the, the side of the airplane. And I think that they figured out um, some of the canards on, the, on these weapons to make sure that they were canned in such a way that when they came down or when the, uh, the, the forward lug uh, fired, that shot the the nose of the bomb uh, into the wind, uh, the wind stream in a way that there was no risk in it coming back up and, and hitting the airplane. So then we started doing trap up releases, which was much better because we were, instead of 15 seconds, we were spending maybe eight seconds uh, looking like a B-52, uh, you know, over a uh, over bad guy.